Now moving on to my oxtail, let me get a piece of this beautiful dark colored oxtail with all this gravy. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Steve from Rockstar Eater coming to you with another rockin' episode. And today I am back with another top 10 list. And today I'm gonna be talking about the 10 Jamaican foods that you need to try. Jamaica has some of the most exciting Caribbean foods that you'll find. If you've never been to Jamaica before or you've never been into a Jamaican restaurant and you're thinking about it, you're probably asking, what are some Jamaican foods that I absolutely need to try? That's what I'm gonna help you with in today's episode. So whether you go to the island or you walk into a local Jamaican restaurant, you'll know exactly what to order. Keep in mind that these aren't the only 10 Jamaican foods out there, but if you start with these 10, then you're gonna get a good introduction into the world of Jamaican food. So stick all the way to the end of this episode so that you can get the lowdown on some traditional popular Jamaican foods that you absolutely need to try. And also if you're new to this channel, take a moment right now to hit that subscribe button as well as the notification bell because I post these food and travel videos weekly that you don't wanna miss out on. So go ahead, do that right now. And we're gonna get started with this list with number one going alphabetically. Aki and saltfish. The list begins with one of the best Jamaican fish and fruit dishes on the island. It is Jamaica's national dish using the national fruit called aki. The aki and saltfish is popular as a breakfast food in Jamaica. It's as it sounds, a dish made of shredded fish that's salty, but the aki is what's truly unique. It's a fruit that is deseeded and boiled, then seasoned and cooked with the flaky saltfish. It tastes kind of like solidified pudding in some ways and is a perfect complement to the saltiness of the fish. So if you want to try one of the most truly unique dishes in Jamaica, then go with the ackee and saltfish because like I said, everybody knows it. National dish, so you definitely need to eat it too. Number two, curry goat. If there is one goat or even curry dish to try in a Jamaican restaurant, it is the curry goat which definitely has that Indian influence in it. The goat meat is cut up into bite-sized pieces and expertly seasoned. It is stir-fried in oil and then stewed in water until it is very tender. It should be tender enough to fall right off the bone. And with the curry powder added, you pretty much get that, a curry-flavored goat. And this dish is usually served with rice and roti. It's definitely one of those foods you need to try, especially if you are open to eating goat, you love goat meat, and you like curry as well, you have found your food. Number three, Escovich. This is another popular fish dish that you should try, especially if you love whole fish. The word Escovich refers to meat or fish that is spiced up and cooked in some form of acidic mixture. And thus you get this Jamaican dish, which is fried, crispy and has a tangy and sour flavor. The fish used is usually red snapper and it comes with onions, bonnet peppers, and pimento seed cooked in vinegar and poured over the fish. And you can eat it with bread or rice. So whether you have it for lunch or for dinner, let me tell you, it's a pretty epic food, this dish. So fish lovers, you definitely need to get this one and I'm pretty sure you're gonna love it. Number four, festival. This is one of Jamaica's greatest snacks and breads. It's a popular street food, but you can also find it in many restaurants. These are some of the most interesting breads you'll ever eat. They call it the Jamaican donut, which is made of flour, cornmeal that is deep fried. What you get is a donut-like food that tastes like cornbread and is a little sweet and crispy all around, but very soft on the inside. Seriously, once you start eating these, you'll never stop. It's pretty addicting. So whether you are on the streets of Jamaica or you're in a local Jamaican restaurant, look out for the festival. Make some room in your stomach to eat it because you might get carried away with it if you eat too much of it, so be careful. Number five, Jamaican patty. This is another one of the characteristic Jamaican foods that you can find as street food or as an appetizer in Jamaican restaurants. These are meat pies with the pastry crust on the outside and the filling of chicken, beef, seafood, or whatever flavor you like. I guess you can say that this is Jamaica's version of an empanada and everybody loves a good hot meat pie 
patty on the island. So whether you go to Jamaica or walk into a local restaurant, you're gonna see these. And you know what, you should order them because especially if you love meat pies, you're gonna like this. It is delicious and is very filling. Number six, jerk chicken. This is undoubtedly the most popular Jamaican chicken dish. It's almost synonymous with Jamaican food itself. The jerk chicken can be found almost everywhere in Jamaica, from street food stands to restaurants. The chicken is seasoned with a signature jerk sauce made of a lot of spices. Then it is smoked over wood to get that ideal smoky flavor. And what you get is a tender, flavorful chicken dish, which is usually served with rice, peas, cabbage, and plantains. You can also find jerk goat and jerk pork in Jamaica as well. But whatever route you go, at least begin with the chicken. If you've never had a jerk chicken before, let me tell you, you have not had Jamaican food. It is really one of the most basic things to get in a Jamaican restaurant, so eat it today. Number seven, mackerel rundown. This is also called dip and fall back. It's another one of the great Jamaican fish dishes. It's pickled mackerel that is cooked in herbs and spices and coconut milk. Oftentimes, you'll find it with a side of roasted green bananas and roasted bread fruit. Unlike the saltfish, this mackerel is not salty, but definitely more on the sweet and creamy side. And it is one of the fabulous breakfast dishes in Jamaica. So whether you are in Jamaica or you're on the island and you're looking for some pretty awesome breakfast, then you gotta remember this dish because this is one of those hearty foods that you're gonna love. So get it and enjoy it. Number eight. Manish Wada. Of course, you can't have a list without some great soups, right? And this soup is truly an adventurous eat. Why? Because it is made of goat's head, feet, and intestines. Yikes! You'll usually find this at a lot of Jamaican festivals. These meats are boiled with bananas, potatoes, yams, and small-sized spinners, which is a kind of like a dumpling. The soup is herby and is pretty good on a cold day. This is one of those dishes that is probably the most challenging thing to eat on this list, but I assure you, it's delicious. So if you happen to find this dish in a Jamaican restaurant, then definitely order it, especially if you are an adventurous eater because it is one of the very special ones to eat on the island. Number nine, oxtail. Oxtail is another can't miss item in Jamaican cuisine. It can be made with jerk sauce or braised in a signature gravy sauce, which is usually made of tomatoes, butter beans, and black pepper. Ideally, the oxtail should be so tender that it falls right off the bone. It is rich, tender, somewhat peppery, but hearty. And it's oftentimes served with rice, peas, and a side of vegetables. It's a heavy meal, but if that's what you're looking for, then by all means get it. Oxtail is another one of those foods that you cannot miss out in a Jamaican restaurant. So definitely try it, especially if you are into Caribbean style oxtail, then Jamaica's also got you covered. And finally, number 10, pepper pot soup. Here's another soup for the soup fans. Jamaica has a few of these, but the one you definitely should try is the pepper pot soup. This soup has Creole influences and is made of callaloo, which is boiled and blended into a puree before being boiled with okra, yams, and even meats like beef. There are a few different ways that you can enjoy the soup. Some places make it with coconut milk added. Some restaurants add dumplings or avocados. But in any case, it is truly one of the most unique soups that you'll find on the island. And you should definitely get it in a restaurant, especially if they have this as part of their soup selections. And a bonus feature, if it's not enough, coconut drops. This is another one of the favorite Jamaican snacks that you can find in many households. The flesh of the dried coconut is cut into cubes and mixed with brown sugar, ginger, and water, and then it is boiled. You then put it on a piece of paper to cool, and this sticky mixture solidifies and turns into an awesome bite-sized snack. If you happen to see these, definitely get them if you love sweet treats. Well, there you have it with 10 popular must-try Jamaican foods. There are a lot more Jamaican foods out there that you can try, of course, but if you start with these 10, you're gonna get a good idea of what Jamaican food is all about. So whether you go to the island someday or you walk into a local Jamaican restaurant, go with this list and you're all good. Anyways, thank you so much for watching this episode of Rockstar Eater. If you enjoy what I'm doing here on the show, like I said, please subscribe because you'll get more of these food and travel videos weekly. And also like this video and comment on the section below 
If there are any Jamaican foods that you think I should have mentioned, or if you've tried any of these, I would love to hear your story. Well, I hope you have a rocking day today, folks, and that you'll try some of this awesome Jamaican food sometime soon, and I'll see you all in the next video.